Dave's Whiskey. My name is Dave, and with me today is Sal. Welcome, Sal. And Thank today you. we are gonna do the final tasting for our vacuum chamber and pressure pot. different tastings that we're going to do today. Um, the very first one uh, that we're going to be playing with is the comparison between just pressure and just vacuum, right? So we have this been sitting on um, pressure for two days and this sitting in the vacuum for two days, um, both at 30. This one's PSI. Okay. The other one's uh, mercury inches. And um, then we're going to go into a two day cycle of I tried to get it every two hours. I wasn't really good at it. There was about four or five stretches where yeah. Yeah, I was solid on the two hours, but then I went to sleep, right? And so I tried as best I could. Yeah, or he was drunk at best, though. You know, that's possible, too. And so I would take it out of one, put it in the other, and I would just keep going back and forth on it. So, okay. Um, which actually has some decent that, color. Yeah, that is best color. It's not too bad. And then I took, um, I was trying to kind of mess with, mother nature here mm -hmm. right because pressure and vacuum all that kind of stuff does happen in the wild yeah so does temperature so i tried to screw with uh vacuum in cold right because vacuum um uh vacuum expands right so it pulls the wood mm -hmm. out and kind of and so i did that within Opens a cold chamber and wow. look at how light that is isn't that crazy and then i went into heat and pressure right because okay. uh heat expands which um uh, and cold contracts but he, with pressure it, it pushes push. the wood tighter right interesting yeah so decent color on that as way well. darker yeah um, also we're trying to fix uh some audio issues right now we've got uh three different microphones right yeah. now in here so who knows is we might actually figure this stuff out um maybe per, per, it, wait. <laughs> I'm hungover. Give me a break. <laughs> uh, before we get into it, um, I was corrected on my socials about I thought it was a one to one ratio with PSI to mercury inches. It is absolutely not. Okay. So, mercury inches, um, I believe, is half as much. Um, no, I'm sorry. PSIs are half as much as mercury inches. So, um, I really should have had this at 15 mercury, mercury inches okay. and this at 30 PSI. Just so you know, like that's where we're at. But um, we're already knee deep into it. So no, just, just redo keep it. on charging through, right? Dive into pressure first. Thank you. What do you think? Did this change with the pressure pot? So it started at 125. I think it dropped five. Drop five? Yeah. That's what it did last time. That's why I said it. <laughs> so. No, no change. No change? No change at ah. all. So I tried to do a little bit better job of, of um, well, also with these guys, I just left it in the chamber. Like I wasn't opening okay. it up. Um, I assume this guy is going to lose a lot. Yeah, because that's when you're rotating. Yep, the pressure yeah. and the vacuum together. I feel like that one's got it. Hmm. Hasn't done my nose. Yeah, that's not, not bad. bad. So I'm getting uh, I'm getting some of that cotton candies in there. Definitely the the candy, sugar candy kind of uh, notes in there. Not necessarily caramels, but slight oak in there too. Ready to get into it? Yeah. Cheers. Boy, very spiky on the alcohol. Yeah, it is. What do you think, Seth? It's hot. That's for sure. So it's definitely, it's still got some of those new make flavors to it. You can tell it's mm -hmm. not been uh, significantly aged. Um, no. The, the smell is better than the taste. Yeah, I agree. 
You can taste all 125 proof. Yes, in you that can. For sure. It's harsh. Yeah. It's very similar to just uh, reaching out there and taking one yeah. right off the jar. Yeah. All right, let's go into the vacuum. What do you think? 123. Down two. Down two. Same. Same? Yeah. Okay. Yep. One Losing my touch. Ooh, smoother. Wow. Yeah, and probably less less oak on it. Yep. Wow. That's interesting. And this is vacuum. This is this is vacuum that we're in right now. Yeah. Let's oh, do it. Way smoother. Much smoother. Um, got some interesting flavor notes in there, too. Um, I'm getting some black tea in there a little bit. Black tea? Yeah. Mm -hmm. on, that, on that finish? I'll try it one more time. Pleasant. That's not mm -hmm. so bad at all, especially after just no, that's the good. Before. Yeah, man, vacuum's really got something going on there. Hmm. Still yeah, vacuum way better than a pressure. Than the pressure. Yeah. No. All right. So we've established that vacuum does better in this in this environment. Yep. So now, while we have these two glasses, and maybe maybe we want to keep some more in there. Okay. Uh, so we're going to go um, vacuum. Vacuum's going to be on the left. Pressure on the right. Okay. So feel free to, here, let me give you one of these. All and right. You can put those back in. Now we're moving into the pressure and vacuum. So this is the two hour swap uh, as best I could. And I'm excited to see what the difference between these these two and the three Um. I'm sorry, this the third one that we're facing right now. Oh, and we should definitely definitely check that one. Check the proof. What do you think? 120. No, what let's go 118. 118. Uh wow, it didn't lose much at all. It's pretty much 120. Wow, 0 for 3. It's pretty much 120. Well, I thought it was gonna lose a lot. That's what I thought. Every time I opened up that vacuum chamber, it was yeah. just wafting of alcohol. Huh. So, odd. Hmm. All right. And now we're in the space. Um, I just, you know, I want to do another color comparison. Okay. Um, so, this is this is the uh, two-hour uh, iterative pressure and vacuum, pressure yep. and vacuum. This is the pressure pot, which is darker out of the vacuum. And so, That's a vacuum. Yep. So interesting, right? How that whole thing works. Let's taste it. Let's okay. Smell. Wow, Ooh. nose is much jumpy. more subdued. You think it's jumpy? Maybe I, maybe I just need to open mine up a little bit. No, no, you're right. It's subdued. Jam it my is mellower, actually. I just jammed my nose in there. I took a huge whiff and I like, <laughs> burned the back of my nostril. <laughs> yeah, these things happen. Uh, that was a bad idea. <sighs> All right, let's try it again. Yeah, mm. I mean, the, a lot of the flavors are just gone out of this. That I was smelling over here on yeah. the vacuum and pressure. Wow. I'm gonna That's way say, smoother. I'm going to have to say even less, yeah, less of the alcohol bites yeah. than the vacuum chamber. That's interesting. Hmm. Hmm. Okay. Let me, you yeah. know what? Let me just do a quick side by side. Um, 
Um, yeah. That's good. It's better, man. It is better. The alcohol burn, like, really is, is, is less. Yeah. It's cut way down. Cut way down. All right. So iterations is That's even, go. <laughs> even better than the vacuum. It is. Vacuum only. It is. Hmm. All right. Now we've solved that little mystery. Interesting. Or at least now we can dive in a little bit further on something else. Yep. Now we move into heat and pressure and vacuum and cold. So which one do you want to go with first, Sal? I want to go with the light one. The lighter one. All right. Vacuum, vacuum and cold. Vacuum and cold. So that was the same amount of time as this vacuum. All of them were two hours, yeah. All of them two hours. Yeah. And that's that color versus that color just because of the cold. Just because of the cold. Interesting. All right. What do you got on the proof? I've been wrong every time, so 124. <laughs> yeah, it's got to be the same yeah, as the other Yeah, because you can't tell on that was... meter, so so yeah. I'm correct. <laughs> it's it's got to be the same because we never opened it, so we're not missing anything. Um, it's a little bit less than 125. So they're four ones. Yay! Hey, <laughs> Sal. There you go. <laughs> you win. Something. What do I win? I don't know. A drink. Yeah. <laughs> you win another tasting. Whether you like it or not. Ooh. This could be bad. It's not a winning. It could be a, it could be. Oh, a it's going to be wonderful. I just think it's so interesting how um, it's so clear. Yeah, how how color does not represent taste in any way. No, not in any way. Ooh, wow! I got some. I got even more of those candies. This is probably sweeter than the first vacuum. Yeah, at least by on the nose. What did you say? It's definitely got more smell. Yeah. Wow. Well, that changed That's smooth. completely. Um, That's smoother than the smell. Let's do this again. Let's do a side by side on, on okay. vacuum and because they, they should, honestly they really should pretty much be the same. Okay. So on the nose. Are you noticing any difference here? I think this one, the clearer one, smells a little more. It, it has, it's got a little more. It does have kick to it in the smell. Yeah, absolutely. I, I, I get just that a, too. Just a little bit. Maybe a little. Maybe a little bit more oak on the original vanilla. Yes, more oak. That's about yeah. All right, let's get into a, a quick rapid fire and just All right. boom boom. Um, so going new. I'm sorry, vacuum and cold. Vacuum first. cold first. All right. Vacuum and cold is better. Yeah, it is, by opinion. far. My goodness. That's pretty nice. That's pretty nice there. That's so smooth. Mm -hmm. That's really good. Not as much oak flavor. No. But it makes up for it in just... <sighs> yeah, the alcohol burn just like just chills right out. Yeah. I mean, and again, we're tasting 125 proof. So, um, all right. Yeah, so my hangover is now gone. Thank you. Heat and pressure. Heat and pressure. New this classes. is the darkest of all of them. Mm -hmm. So if we're if we're talking heat and pressure here, um, pressure was not our favorite before. Okay. So we're kind of thinking like, what? Well, this is probably not going to be very good. And I'm, I haven't I'm, tasted I'm, any of these beforehand, so I don't uh, you know I don't know anything more than you do. Okay. I believe you, Geraldo. <laughs> 
What was, what was Geraldo? What was his, his thing that he was known for? Like, there was some kind of, like, safe or something? Like yeah, that? it was the uh, El Capone safe. That's it. Yeah. Which was empty. And there was nothing in it. <laughs> <laughs> but it was still fun to watch. It's so great. Yeah, I'm that old. <laughs> cool. Wow. Uh, yeah, I mean, it's, it's more flavorful. It's punching your face. Um... If I had to describe the flavors on here, or the, the smell that's coming across, mm -hmm. it's taking me a minute. Wow, it's taking me a minute. It's buggy. Uh, yeah, I mean, it's you get your nose in there and it's it burns you. Um, but I'm getting more more of the oaky oakiness in there. Mm -hmm. hmm. I'm getting almost a, like a little nutty kind of finish on it. Maybe a, a peanut peanuts or something like that, or a walnut. Can I? But it's it's yeah. very faint. Alright, let's get into it, man. Okay. Let's do a whirl. So the, the alcohol burn is still there, um, but it calms but, off quickly. Yeah, it does. Um, it's better, in my opinion, it's better than the um, pressure pot. The pressure one, yeah, without the heat. Um, hmm. It's got more flavor on the back end. It does have more flavor on the back end, which is interesting. This is probably one of the most flavorful, but not the um, the alcohol burn. Correct. Yep. It's so, smoother to drink, but it has more, much more flavor to it. Yeah. Than the pressure without heat. Yes. Sal? Yep. Hmm. What's your favorite so far? I, I gotta go with vacuum cold. Boy, just vacuum cold I'm, was good. I'm, yeah. I'm just because I'm a smooth, easy drinker guy, and that's smooth and easy. Yeah, I like that too, man. That's Honestly, these are a toss-up. It's very difficult to pick one. Yeah. Because a lot of them have their own kind of uh, characteristics that make them they're, oh, they're decent, definitely like unique. decent, really good. So... Um, Man, I you know what when we started into this pressure thing, uh, you know I learned a lot from from the Cleveland uh, Distillery. Yep, who, who's been doing a lot of this stuff for a while. So props to you guys out there, uh, kind of leading the way. Yeah, looking forward to seeing it. But I was thinking like, man, it's probably not going to be significant in just two days. In the two days that I'm playing with, um, and my goodness, man! But it is. This is it's amazing. This is significant. I can't believe the cold color. The cold so mild. Color. Why I don't get. I Interesting. Uh, if you know uh, the scientists that are out there, um, you know, and you know why this is this is so clear, um, give us a give us a holler. Give me a comment. You know, send it in there. Um, I'd love to know more. So this is uh, this is interesting. Yeah, very nice. Um, any final thoughts there, Sal? No, no. I got nothing. Yeah. <laughs> All right, man. Well, let's do this up. Like we always do. Cheers, y'all. It's a better whiskey. <laughs>